Hello, I'm Chef Steve Krullen. In this section, I'm going to be talking about the TurboChef C3 oven, the most versatile in the TurboChef line. Ideal for concession stands, up to five-star restaurants, specializing in roasting, browning, and broiling up to 10 times faster. Sound impossible? Well, I'm going to demonstrate. Today, we'll make some salmon en croute. This is a three ounce piece of salmon surrounded by a boisson cheese and wrapped in a delicate puff pastry. I'm going to egg wash for some color. Now normally in a conventional oven, this would take about 35 minutes to cook. We're gonna cook it in our C3 in just about three minutes. I'm also gonna cook some asparagus. This asparagus would normally take about three minutes. In our C3 oven, we'll cook it in one minute. The C3 comes programmed with a variety of menu items and can be customized to fit any menu. Choose your category, choose your food item, and you're done. Anyone from low to high skill labor can operate the oven because it's so easy. The food will come out every time with chef quality results. I choose the item, press the on croup button, and we're done. Simple as that. You're probably thinking, how are we able to cook with chef quality results up to 10 times faster than conventional methods? The difference is that we're using a unique patented combination of heated impinged air and microwave. The internal heaters heat the air in the cooking chamber to 500 degrees Fahrenheit, which circulates at speeds up to 60 miles an hour, shrouding the food. The air then passes through the catalytic converter where excess grease and odors are combusted and removed. The air is reheated and returned into the cooking chamber. While the air is circulating, simultaneously microwave system pulses precise bursts of energy from the bottom of the oven, evenly cooking the food from the inside out. I'm going to take a wet towel to wrap the asparagus in. I wanna do that to create some steam inside of the oven going to help us with our speed, our texture of the asparagus when it's done, and our color. Okay. I choose the item, find the asparagus, press, and we're done. Oh, sounds like our salmon on croute is ready. Looks great. Good color, nice aeration on the pastry, wonderful. Asparagus is ready. Okay. Let me just move this asparagus to one side. Okay. Now normally I would serve this whole, but I want to slice it because I want you to see the salmon. I want you to see just how moist this is. Look at that moisture, beautiful. It cooks that way every single time. Okay. Okay, all we need to do now Finish our plate with the asparagus. That's good and hot. Let's take a look, look at that color. Nice thing about cooking something so fast is that we will retain the color. Beautiful, all we gotta do now is put a couple of pieces just to finish dressing our plate. Beautiful. Total cook time for both items, less than three minutes. Enjoy. Next, I'd like to cook this Chateaubriand. This is a four pound piece. Normally, it would take about 35, 40 minutes in a regular conventional oven. In our C3, eight minutes. Our Parisian potatoes would take about 45 minutes. In our C3, six minutes. And our roasted vegetables normally would take oh, about 10 minutes. In our C3, four minutes. Now, I sense there's some skeptics out there. Okay, watch and see. 
put our Chateaubriand into the oven. Find our product, find our item, and we're done. Same thing with our Parisian potatoes. Place them into the oven. Find our product, find our item, and we're done. We'll save our vegetables till a little later. Now I know what you're thinking. We just had salmon in there. So you think we're gonna end up with a Chateaubriand that smells like fish. Couldn't be more wrong. The C3 self-cleaning catalytic converter continually cleans the air inside the oven and eliminates transfer of flavors and odors. So our Chateaubriand is gonna smell and taste like Chateaubriand. The C3 is an extremely versatile oven. You can cook all of this wonderful food in it. You know, I travel the United States quite a lot. And I was telling this consultant down in Miami that I hadn't found anything I couldn't cook in this oven. So he says, I bet you couldn't cook pasta in there. So I took the bet. I took a small bowl of uh, water with a little drop of oil, and I had that water boiling in our oven in less than a minute. I put the thin spaghetti in, and in less than three minutes, the spaghetti was cooked. I made a believer out of him. <whistles> Sounds like our potatoes are done. Okay, let them rest here for a second, and I'll put our vegetables in. Same thing. Place the vegetables in the oven, find our product, find the item, and we're done. Let's take a look at these potatoes. Color is excellent, beautifully cooked, nice and hot, obviously, and nice and fluffy. There's our chateau. Looks great, look at that. Nice color, beautiful caramelization on the top. It's important to let a piece of meat like this rest after it comes out of our oven. Because we shroud the food with very hot air, the moisture is gonna to migrate to the middle of the meat. So we need to let that relax and rejuvenate the moisture, come back into the meat, and it's gonna be perfect. Our vegetables are just a couple of seconds away. Normally, it would take you a good hour and a half to prepare a meal like this. We cook this in our C3 oven in under 20 minutes. Oh, there's our vegetables. Let me just move this out of the way. Beautiful. Look at the color. Color is just perfect. Al dente, just right. In our ovens, you can program to cook exactly the same way every single time. So it doesn't matter who's gonna be doing the cooking. It'll be exactly the same way. Now for the chateau. I know you've all been waiting. Let's take a look. I know it's cooked just right. Perfect. Just look at that. Couldn't get any better. Now we just need to finish off a little garnish and we're ready for lunch. Potatoes cooked beautiful. Roasted vegetables, great color, al dente. Chateaubriand cooked perfect. All in our C3 oven. Enjoy. Now we're gonna make some delicious desserts, a chocolate souffle and baked Alaska. Normally, it would take about 18 to 20 minutes for the souffle, and about 10 minutes for our baked Alaska. In our C3, it'll take about one minute. Beautiful. Again, very simple. Place the item in the oven. Find the product. Find the item, and we're done. Same with the baked Alaska. Find the product, find the item, and we're done. This souffle reminds me of a French chef that came to see me in New York City from a very famous hotel. I said, chef, what is it you want to do? He had a beautiful Bing cherry and pistachio souffle. He wanted his customers to order it after dinner, not before and he wanted to reduce his cook time. So I said, chef, you're already here. Let's try it. So we made the souffle, popped them in the oven, and in just over a minute, the souffle was done. Beautiful. 
Now, as I picked them up off the floor and dusted them off, he wrote a check and bought the oven on the spot. There's our baked Alaska. Beautiful. Excellent. Now, we just need to finish off a little vanilla ice cream. And a little scoop. Here we go. Plate for our baked Alaska. Perfect. As you can see, nice sponge cake. The ice cream is still firm, but soft. Two delicious desserts cooked in our C3 in just over a minute. Enjoy. Now let me show you how to access that program and edit mode in the C3. With the oven in the off position, I'm going to hit both of these arrows together and enter a pin number. Be sure and ask permission and for your pin number before you make any changes. Here the oven is asking me a question. Am I happy with the oven set temperature at 500 degrees? Yes, I am. Hit enter. Now I'm into edit groups. Let's take a look at something we've already cooked. Let's go to our custom products and our chateau. Here's our edit screen. Here is the word custom. If I wish to change that name, by using the keypad, I would type in the new word and arrow down. If we wish to change the item name, type in the new word, arrow down. Now here's the number of times we've cooked a chateau in this oven. If I wish to zero it out, I hit zero. If I wish to change the time, hit the arrow down and I will change the time. I'm going to change it to 8.30. 8.45 was a little too long. All I do is hit 8.30 and arrow down. Now I'm into my cooking events. We have up to six different cooking events that we can program into our oven for each particular item. This is the number of events we're going to use to cook the chateau. This column is a percentage time column, which means this column must add up to 100%. 100% of this 8 minutes and 30 seconds we're using different percentages of air and wave. If your product is dense or frozen, you want to start out with a lot of wave and low air. As the product gets cooked, you want to rest out from the wave and increase the air to finish brown and crisp. Now, if I wish to change, all I do is type in the new change and arrow down. I'm going to hit save and we're done. To get the oven back to its normal operating position, we're going to hit the back key all the way out until the oven says off, turn the oven on, and we're done. Assorted mushrooms in one minute, roasted chicken in 12 minutes, marinated shrimp in two minutes, toasted gourmet sandwich in 45 seconds, only in a Turbo Chef oven. Each oven has up to 128 programs, allowing for an almost endless variety of menu possibilities. You can, of course, customize your menu by adding your own recipes. You can do this by experimenting with your settings, searching through our online cookbook at turbochef.com, or by contacting our culinary support team. They will gladly assist you with adding that recipe to your oven's menu. You can make all of these delicious foods you see here, and many, many more. And you and your staff can all make them easily, quickly, and with chef quality results every time.